Hello everyone, I bought a Radeon 6500 XT graphics card for $200 and today we'll see how good this card performs in 1080p gaming and define if you should consider this card for your budget build. I have a MSI version and it has two coolers. This card is not hot and the version with one cooler is also good. But moving forward I say this cooling works great, you will see later in the test. First time seeing only two ports on the back, it's HDMI port and display port. Even though it's a budget card we have a plastic backplate on the back side to prevent port damage and you can see the cooling pipe and 6 pin connector. This graphics card does not require much power, 500 watts power supply will be enough. The card shows best results with PCIe 4.0. It still works with PCIe 3.0 but you will get less FPS in games. Therefore I will test this card with Intel i5-11400 which supports PCIe 4.0 and B560 chipset motherboard which is also supports PCIe 4.0 and 16GB of RAM. In Apex Legends on high settings getting 80 plus FPS most of the time. You can see all 4GB of video memory in use. CSGO runs with no problem over 200 FPS. PUBG 60 FPS with drops to 45 on ultra settings, but on medium high settings you can get 70 plus. Days Gone medium settings over 80 FPS most of the time. In Elden Ring on high settings getting stable 60 FPS. At the end we have a budget card which is good for the price of $200. It's for gaming only in 1080p and if you do not set the ultra settings, which makes it good candidate for budget builds. The MSI version has great cooling and the temperature stays below 60 degrees in most of the games. Finishing up, thanks for watching this video, comment your thoughts below and subscribe to see more content like this.